Jaguars. Okay, now the signs are going to be off because, see, somebody's got them upside down in, in their hands. And we did have that girl stunning with palms in her hand. So we've got a lot of, a lot of issues already, safety issues. Look at that little bitty one, little bitty bitty. Her sign's upside down. Yeah. Yep, it sure is. I, I saw that when she was coming out. That's the Live Oak Jaguars, their sideline uh, side performance. Oh, she tripped over the sign, and goodness gracious, see, that was a quick one. Let's hear it for <laughs> the Live Oak Jaguars. Sophia Blunt is the most spirited Jaguar. The coach picks, picks that. The judges don't pick that most spirited on that squad. Cause, okay. Because we don't, we don't know the girls' names. So I don't want to anybody to wonder how we picked that. Right. Okay? Now, we, we, judges we have pick, nothing to do with that. Yeah. We have nothing to do with that. No. And here come Our the New Braunfels Junior Cougars. Will be a halftime performance. The New Braunfels? New, New Braunfels Junior Cougars. Cougars. Okay, you see they, they have different color palms. One, they got the black in their right hand and the red in their uh, left. I'm hoping they use that to their advantage. You know, like use the black at one time and the red at the other time. You got, you got one of them so that's got it backwards. They use for visuals. Oh, no. Yeah, she's over there at the far left. Yep. Yeah, I see that. This is their time they can use it for a, a visual effect. Dead eight counts to begin with. Good ripple. Jump. I don't think she knows she's her pom poms wrong. Yeah. No. Good ripple again, front to back. Start wheels, round off, toe touches. Okay, we're building. Ah, they lost one over there. Lost, lost each lost side, side, right? Yeah. Going too fast. Yeah. Building too fast. See, I didn't get to take a picture. Yeah, they were rushing it. That's the new Braunfels Junior Cougars. See, they went so fast I couldn't take a picture. I couldn't even tell you what happened on those stunts. So, see, when they build a stunt, you should tape, put it up as long so I can take a picture. Well, I think the Junior Great Cougars, uh, they're, they're, they're not a new intro. organization, but I think this is their first year doing a cheer competition. Okay. So, they need to come to the coaches' clinic? <laughs> yes, they do. So. <laughs> So, see, there's several things you can already ask about trivia questions. What's the legal size of a bow? What kind of, what kind of violations have you already seen on the floor? Right. You know, so there are several questions you could come up with here directly. But. Well, I'll tell you what we need to do, Linda, is you need to send, uh, email me some of this information, your email address, all that stuff. Yeah. What we'll do is I'll create a promo to air on Typer Radio. Okay. And we'll start airing that on a regular basis and so put it in the That's rotation. And how many times have we seen an illegal split yep. already? You know? Absolutely. You know, so Linda Lundy puts on a clinic for cheer competitions. Uh, you can email her at linda at cheerintegrity.com. 
I'm on Facebook, Cheer Integrity. She's on Facebook, but we'll, we'll put that information together and put it out there as Let's well. See, we've got three, four, five, six, we got seven, Cheer eight. Integrity and National Cheerleading Week. All right. It's both on Facebook. Here come the Cypress Tigers. Look how we've got little back to big. They're clicking. Awful close to those girls in that tumble pass. She was. Dead eight count. You see how the how the floor is weighted? We got little too big to this side. Yep. So that's a violation? No, that's not a violation. It's just a visual that we shouldn't. It should be weighted different. There go the Cypress Tigers. But I'll tell you what, you know, well, watching the, the little ones, they, along were, the big ones, they were right with they, each other. They, 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 were, they knew the routine. They yeah. weren't looking over at the bigger ones to see, oh, am I doing this I right? Know it, I know it's that too. They were very synchronized. Yes, they were. Up next is the Laferia Lions out of the Rio Grande Valley. But as a visual, that was that was an an off cast visual with it being like that. Yes. A lopsided visual, I should say. Oh, if you don't want the trophy, I'll take it. I'll <laughs> <laughs> She's hanging the trophy out there. I was like, oh. Hey, now she said, gave it to Our her husband. Hey, you better hold this. You better hold this. Kenny Long trying to step over there the and Lefaria snatch this. The Lions. All right, here comes the Leferia Lions. They are a repeat organization. They, they've always shown out pretty good with a lot of good numbers. And look, pretty, look, pretty look at this group that's coming in. Pretty oh, palms. This, this is a large this is a squad. squad. I'm not going to try and count them. This is a very large squad. Oh, and look how they've set up. Oh. Look, right in the middle. I mean, that is a great setup. I'm telling great you, I, I am highly impressed with the Rio Grande Valley squads this year. We will, we will, we will. Good, oh, wow. Good basket toss in the beginning. Good opening. Good visual effects here. Good visual effects here at the yeah. opening. Very nice. They're covering the floor very well. Good, good facials right here in the middle. Yes. Good point right, right here, here in the front. front. Look at this one to the far right. Now get the timing down. The jumps are off. Taking a little long time to get in their places. The stunts had good facials in there. Yes. Very entertaining routine so far. There's action at every, every yeah. point of the routine so far. Oh, you see how they're, they're cartwheeling to get into their position? Yes. There's the, none of that belly ache. The choreography has been designed yes. to get them where they need to be. Look at, Look at this. Yes. Great wow. choreography on that. Yes. What team is this? This is the Laferia Lions. And a fantastic job by the Laferia Lions. A nice routine by them. Good choreography for that. Let's hear it for the Laferia Lions. Most spirited goes to Jaslyn. 
I, I'm telling you. There were some good facials out there. Everything that we have seen in the individuals now here in the team, that's our first RGV group we've seen, and they are just on their game this year. I was very impressed with that squad. 